Aye. You trust me with this letter. I met George Washington. I remember there. I did not find all clues about my mother on the docks. I did not pick the book up from the quay. I could have joined Sir Holmes. I could have made an un unexpected encounter. Nothing ever happens, shame. Level two. Okay, so we got some of that. All right, so we have four points available. Um, that's pretty cool that we unlocked manipulation at one point. Agility, questioning. Notice anything suspicious in someone's behavior or appearance. Conviction. Etiquette. Politics, diversion. I think I might do this. Get etiquette to two. That are your veiled insults. And then I might start to unlock a different one. Let's unlock occultism. Yeah, let's do that. Well, I like the choices you made. You made. All right, here's your choices. What you read during the adventure. Each manuscript you read can confer skill points at the end of the quest. Manuscripts to equip. So we have plus one in diversion, plus one in in conviction. Can we see diversion? Diversion is this guy, and conviction is that. The force of your will and your attitude. Okay. I think we'll do the conviction. We can't do both. Start quest. Your, yo, what up, Ed? How you doing, man? You haven't missed much, much here, Ben. We literally, I mean, we started the game an hour ago, but um, we're still trying to figure out what's going on here. The servants are not very efficient. Durache can't be found. Basically, his mother They'll is missing. Their search time is restricted. And there's a lot of choices. An eye on Adams. I can Just got back from the gym. Her. Nice, dude. Yeah. I need well, to work out. Dude, case, I've, I do I I've need to go to the gym the last two mornings, but I haven't from gone. I've understood, the search but I'm going to try to go tomorrow morning. Hasn't turned up any results. Not yet, no. But we've put her son in there. Perhaps he'll find something. Hmm. That might come in handy. Hmm. Louis grows impatient at not yet having met the famous Lord Mortimer. He will meet him tomorrow. Oh, what a pity to lose a night at the start of the game. Are you waiting for someone? A young French soldier. During oh. our game of chess? Don't worry, Gregory. The game won't disappear. I'll have one of my this men. This dude is funny you. looking, yeah. Don't trouble yourself. They all look know my way like out. very weird. Ah, good evening, gentlemen. Please forgive me for this. Is this Napoleon? Hour. It is never too late. <laughs> we have much to discuss. Okay. One last move. Their eyes. Don't <laughs> worry. Our games always seem to end like this. Or always start like this. Falcorian. Take a seat. <laughs> Oh my gosh. It was Napoleon Bonaparte. What the heck? How am I calling these? <laughs> yeah, I think the guy just has a lot of makeup on his face. A little nighttime stroll, Mr. President. There's nothing like it for a good night's sleep. Do not hesitate to ask a servant to show you back. The corridors seem quite safe. Peppermint, lime flower, and valerian. 
my miracle remedy when one can't get to it's like the Joker. A very good night to you, Mr. President. Thank you. And to you too, sir. That's our room. 1700 Joker. Keeps getting these nosebleeds. That's not good. Ew. I'm coming. Clean that up. Don't just sniff it back up. That's gross. Hurry to answer the door. All right, I'm going. I'm going. Are we actually on episode two? Like, is it that short? I think we just complete. I think we're still on episode one. We just completed a quest. So they call it. No, no, no. No, you're no not. not in the least. Is something wrong? I'm going to need your help. Do you remember the young lady we spoke of in the hall? Yes. Elizabeth Adams. Home introduced her to us. Yes. Well, she is the daughter of my friend, the Vice President, John Adams. But she is supposed to be dead. Yeah, I think, yeah, I that's think that's bizarre. how it works. Fair enough. Good heavens. I was present at her funeral. It is disturbing indeed. Wait, what? Yes. I need to make sure it's her. That's where you come in. I want you to distract Elizabeth while I search her room. And perhaps get my oh hands God, on look some at the pictures on the wall. information. At least I hope so. Elizabeth is in the small salon. It's like foretelling the future. Her, I just need ten minutes. I think. But if my vision is true, there are two men nearby discussing very important issues, and one of them looks much like Mortimer. Washington is very kind, but I came to this island for my mother, not for his ghost stories. Yeah, but we could find something else by helping him. Count on me, sir. Let's Thank help you, him. my friend. Keep Elizabeth downstairs as long as possible. She must not return to her room. Trust me. Son of Lafayette. According to Washington, Lady Adams is in the small salon. I better hurry. <laughs> He's the best character so far, and that's not saying much. <laughs> I can see what you mean. Yeah, he's definitely my favorite character so far. Look at these photos on the wall. Well, what is this guy doing? What are you doing there? Huh? You listening uh, my in? Son. Oh, you are a godsend. What's the matter, Your Eminence? I believe a Miss Adams may be in danger. What do you mean? Do you hear that? She is being manhandled in this small salon. By whom? I don't know exactly. Uh, a thug, a Frenchman, it seems. By the cut of his cloth, I'd say he's a member of the French Revolutionary Government. You should do something, my son. Hmm. Uh, sounds dangerous. Shit. I was supposed to make sure Adams wouldn't go back to her room. Don't worry, Your Eminence. I'll take care of it. Probably nothing to worry about. <laughs> do you want me to call for help? Please don't do anything. I'm sure with a little goodwill, everything will work out fine. Don't go and wake up the whole manor, please. Oh, thank you, my son. May God watch over you. Who do you think you are? Forget multiple paths. There are multiple paths to reach your objective. It may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Me, sir. If we were in France, I'd have sent you to the guillotine for what you just said. Please, just let me go back to my room. Hey, hey. You, stay out of it. This is none of your business. I'm gonna teach this little slut how to behave. What the hell is going on? Huh? I don't think you know who I am. Stop. I beg you. I, I didn't mean to. Don't hit me, please, sir. Shit. Uh. If I step in, Adams might just run back uh. to your room. And if I do nothing, yes, Washington will have enough time to search, but this girl's gonna suffer. Damn it, what should I do? Risk Adam's gonna go. run. Yeah, we can't Stay just. Out of it, boy. Our job is to make sure that she's okay. What are you playing at? 
I told you to mind your own business, boy. Hey, listen, if listen, you think listen. You can side with this whore and then just walk away. You're out of your mind. Give uh, me one good reason not to knock you down. <laughs> Sir, you obviously do not know who I am, or you'd keep your distance. Ooh, one more like that, and I'm gonna get scared. Don't think you're getting away with it that easy. How did that pass? I'm sick of all these talks. Pass. If we were in Paris, <laughs> I'd send you all to the guillotine. And on top of it all, a woman telling me how I ought to behave? I won't stand for it. Oh, okay, okay. Wait a minute. What? Don't tell me you're going to defend these harlots. I believe in man. From speech comes dialogue. From dialogue, peace is born. And from peace, great destinies flourish. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> I get the feeling you're trying to put one over on me. If that's the case, you're making a big mistake. Sorry about that. Look, there's no point in us aggravating each other. Let's both just go our separate ways. Don't move. We're not done yet. You wanted to be the knight in shining armor and save the damsel in distress. Let's see how brave you are. Oh God, this, this concert, someone threw you off balance. The cost of it increases your, oh God, he just pulled a gun on us. Listen, okay. We barely know each other and it seems everything went a bit too far. Let me apologize if I offended you in any way. What's wrong? Someone cut your balls off? I can't do anything else. Listen, beg. we barely know each other, and it seems everything went a bit too far. Let me apologize if I offended you in any way. What's wrong? Someone cut your balls off? Oh, God. You should have kept your big nose out. Ow. Okay, yeah. Yeah, so it's still episode one. Damn. That was a rough night. <laughs> He's got the black eye, too. Bastard caught me dead to rights. Uh -oh. Liam, you have failed me. I don't know what you were doing, but Elizabeth returned much too soon. Any earlier, and I would have been caught. I didn't get time to search through everything, but I did manage to find what I was looking for. The young <laughs> lady really is John Adams' daughter. Signed, George Washington. No, it said that we well didn't done, get to pick up the thing President that she United dropped. The States asked for your assistance and you screwed up. Mother finds out, I, I get the feeling I'll never hear the end of it. Not for a few years, anyway. Now, what was I going to do last night? Ah, yes, search the room. According to what I saw in my vision, this room was Mother's before I got it. Maybe she left something behind that will help me find her. Manuscripts to read. Okay, so this time we can read, uh, this guy. Look for clues of mother. Do we have something that can heal us? I don't, I don't think we do, but. Charismatic presence. I'm a gentleman. <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. The torture of Ixion. Grants you exalted state. Temporarily see the immunities and vulnerabilities affecting a dialogue, choice, and a conversation. You cannot carry more than five. Cool. 
condemned by the gods to lose his mind because of his arrogance. The incredulity of St. Thomas. Why is Caravaggio writing material? Damn. Don't have enough. I think this plus one to inspiration of Saint Matthew. I have is, uh, time to unpack my yeah, case. Please excuse hmm. me, but means all of our skills are plus one. Saint Francis of Assisi. Like I think we need another before superior voices. The conversion of Saint Paul by Caravaggio. Look at that. What? It's incredible. It doesn't look like a copy, but I was sure the original was in Rome. Saturn devouring his son. Again? I saw the same theme in the hall. <laughs> Saint Jerome and the angel. Judith beheading Holofernes. Ironic in a way, when you know that the artist represented herself as Judith beheading her mentor, who had raped her. I want that painting. <laughs> hmm, nothing here. Oh, there's something on the ground. A nice, strong coffee, though. Collector's coin. Inferno by Dante. Abandoned oh, that's hope. the. Yeah. This bookcase is well stocked. I think that's Dante's oh, Inferno. The back the wrong way round. A voyage around the world. The travel log of the explorer Louis Antoine de Bougainville. One of mother's favorite books. What a coincidence. Hmm. And I don't believe in coincidences. It's just too much. I don't know what's going on here, but if you felt threatened, I'll bet you'd leave a clue, wouldn't you, mother? Found it. A faint sign of the order. Barely visible. Mother, you undoubtedly must have hidden a clue in this book. Let's see if I can find anything else in this room. Examine the page with the symbol. Vigilance. Oh my gosh, dude. Not far from solving the puzzle, I must keep searching. Look, Something on the ground. Markings on the floor. Eh, just a bit worn out. I was hoping to find something leading to a secret passage. <laughs> but what if? Saint Jerome and the Wait, angel. this one. There's a circle around the lock here. Must be the trunk Mortimer was talking about. The key should open it. Use the key. What? Something she yellow? Wrote, Effects of Sœur de Richet to be given to her son, Louis. I should probably take it. Amber fragments. You found an amber fragment. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase your maximum effort skill or points by one. I have okay, no cool. Space left. I'll retrieve it later. Wait, really? I have no space left. Oh. I'll retrieve it later. That's the, uh. Okay. I got it. Wait. Nope. Can't open that. That's Dante's Inferno book, I'm pretty sure. Let's go outside. This place is huge. Huge. Here's something will undermine my botanist appreciation for the local climate. Hmm. What? Let's recap. My mother was in this room. I found a rare edition of her favorite book. She must have left something behind. She must have used the writing materials. What if she used lemon juice instead? An old trick used to hide messages. A like message on the back the of the Declaration of, the, of, of Independence. The now, how do I reveal the message? Uh, find something to reveal hidden messages. I didn't even come back inside and this thing brought me back inside. Take the candlestick. Yeah, just put it in your jacket. Not gonna... Nah, it wouldn't do anything, right? Nothing. Nothing. Tch. 
going with the flow, right? Take the ink. Might as well take everything we find. Incredulity of Saint Thomas. Why is Caravaggio represented Saint Thomas putting his finger in the wound? Huh. Thomas looks on but doesn't touch. Collector's coin. Let's add all those. It's pretty cool. Nothing out there. All right, let's try the ink and uh, what's the next game line up after this? Not sure just yet. Um, probably one of the games that I picked up recently. So I'm thinking, um, possibly Sekiro. Um, maybe Disco Elysium, but I think I need like an action style game. So I might go Sekiro, Disco Elysium, then Neo, then possibly Resident Evil 2 or like put Resident Evil 2 in one of those. I don't know if I want to play Resident Evil 2 just yet, but I kind of want to try playing it sometime soon. Pour some ink, burnish the pagel. Ah, oh. it's working. The ah, reveals nice. The message. Let's see what my mother wrote. Glad I didn't We're just pour ink on there. Up. We must pass by the Gorgon. Gorgon was the name of Medusa in Greek mythology. On the other hand, where all eyes size you up, I don't get it. And judging by the number of paintings in the manor, could be anywhere. only one I finished was Revelations, so it was so good. Beware, hero. The beast always charges the best Which one? protected Wait, soldier, what? and that's its weakness. What is my mother trying to tell me? Have you gone to Assassin's so Creed Revelations? You found something important, but you must have also felt like you were in great danger. Now I better hurry and find that damn Medusa. Sir, dinner is served in the red salon. Typical. I'm not hungry. Please give my apologies to all the guests. Uh, Sir Holm requests your presence, sir. Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to wait. Oh, Resident Evil Revelations. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Tell gotcha. I'll be there in a minute. Oh, right. Okay. Yeah. I think I actually have those on, um... Oh, I can't reach it. Damn it. <laughs> Let's run up there. All right, let's go to the red salon on the first floor. I am pretty sure I have revelations. If I get a chance, I may have to take a little tour through the rooms of the other guests. Ooh. Should I? Oh, which one was the room of? Or Might should we just take a different stairway? Why? Might be better to take a different oh, stairway. I guess. We could just easily walk past them, but Who's that this? must be the door to the room of the soldier I saw in my vision. Napoleon Bonaparte. Can't get in there. Never mind. All right, yeah, let's let's stick to the story. Let's not bother going extra steps. It hasn't picked up enough where I want to take extra steps. Excuse me, Monsieur de Richet. I really need to talk to you. Is this about last night? No, that was just a misunderstanding. I'm sure it was a little bit my fault, too. There's no excuse for that man's horrible behavior. You ought to tell Sir Holm. Look, the only thing that I care about is that I've lost something precious. I'm not worried about Jack Peru. A coin. You're her son. Sarah de Richet's son. Yes, why? Last night, I found out that your mother was on the island. What are you doing here? Looking for her? 
Excuse me, but speaking frankly, why would you care? I know your mother very well. What? What do you mean? Really? Yes, I have been in your mother's care ever since I was born. She nursed you. Oh, I wouldn't say nursed. No, I remember her stare, cold as ice. Her sadistic hands pressing over my mouth to silence me while I screamed in pain. What? I remember her knees, too. She yeah. held me down with them while she I... cut and burned scars into me. Hold on a minute. What do you mean? You can ask her when you see her. Huh. She's getting more and more agitated. I had a feeling that... Look, I've... I've got to go. Wait. I need to know more <sighs> Questioning about you skill my required. I need to get Why that. Why did she put you through all of that? There must be some reason for what she did. What's so many times that comes up. Uh, uh, oh, shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, God. Oh, uh, uh, um, uh, to find, to, uh, to I find the find truth. Out what really happened. No, you really don't want to know what your mother did when I shed my first blood at puberty. On the contrary, you can tell me anything. Let me be my own judge. I know your little game. You're no different from the rest of them. What? No, I'm you not. You not give a damn about me. The only thing you're interested in is finding out about your mother. Don't yeah, say that. Because that's not why I tried to save to you last you. night. Some people care about you, don't they? Mention her mother, mention her brother, mention her father. Take your father. I'm sure he tried everything to save you. Sure, he tried everything to keep me from upsetting his political affairs. Once I was declared insane, I was nothing but a burden that got in the way of his career. By leaving me with your mother, he made all the horrors possible. Oh no. Uh, her brother? Mention her mother? Oh god. Don't you have a brother? I have three, but not one of them has bothered to help me. Charles and Thomas Bail. were kept away from me to make sure I wouldn't upset them. As for John, the only time he visited me the was game to logic is not existent. He never publicly compromised his career. Yeah, I'm kind of confused. I, I didn't know. You're an only son, right? Does it show? If you had a brother or sister, you'd know the way blood ties are unbreakable. Except in my family, unfortunately. <sighs> Failed. I've got nothing more to say to you. Figure it out yourself. Talent unlocked, tactless. Wait, what's that talent? Where is it? Tactless, using manipulation costs you one extra effort point, but you gain one skill in linguistics. Fail two confrontations. <laughs> Trait unlocked, naive. Wait, what's that one? Betrayed. Naive. You did not persuade Elizabeth to talk about your mother. Oof. I still enjoy the game though because of the choices and stuff. So like, it has its replay value in a way. The story might not be the greatest, but I feel confident that this is gonna go somewhere. So frustrating because you can't do anything, but you know what other talents or traits you need until you don't have them. Yeah, that that is true. Like I get what they're trying to do with the whole. Um, Lord Lord Mortimer certainly has a taste for staging rooms. I get what they're trying to do with all of the. What can I do for you, sir? The skills and stuff, but there's night. so many things that are locked behind skills. Never mind, take my leave. Go to the red salon on the first floor. I'm assuming that's this one, maybe? I like the environment, just wish there was more exploring. I'm not trying to get punched in the face again. Dear friends, I bid you welcome. I hope the night was not too short. Your Eminence, Duchess, Monsieur de Richet, allow me to introduce our new guests. They arrived during the night. Johann Christoph von Wollner, Minister of Religious Affairs and close aide of Frederick William II, King of Prussia. Napoleon <laughs> Bonaparte, 
lieutenant of the French Revolutionary Army. He's not as short as you would think. French Revolutionary Tribunal Judge. Unfortunately, my friends, like that's such Mortimer a cool dining, not be joining us dining this morning, area. But he yeah. should be with us later. So let us begin. What is so Mortimer playing? He tells me to come urgently, and he sends no one to meet me. My friend, uh -huh. let's validate him. Dialogue timer while the time limit is over and answer is automatically selected. Thank you again for the vine. Opportunity uh, failed. It is served every day at the Rip. king's table. I am yes, delighted. Volner and Piaggi seem to be getting along well. My dear Johan, how are you? Glad to make you? landfall at last. And yourself? Very well. And your husband? He's poorly. The French Revolution gives him terrible headaches. Oh, I understand. I shall feel better too as soon as the situation is settled. If by chance the French crisis is emulated in Berlin, there will always be a refuge for you in London, my dear. Your offer does you honor, Emily. But London is much Picking closer to Paris than Berlin. Beware. <laughs> the French. Intoxicated, you have used four consumable items during a single quest or consumed a no noxious item dialogue. Oh, God. Golden... Oh my god, I'm an I'm idiot. Of sailing up the Thames. A golden elixir? Do I have one? <laughs> I don't think I have any. I didn't know that you could get drunk. Great to the houses of power. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my friend. I am shaking in my clogs. <laughs> I think she did change outfits. It's just a different... Yeah, it's a different one. But it's similar. You're oh. <laughs> a Prussian Britannic coalition is not good for France. The last time we fought against them, our empire went up in smoke. Is the wine to your liking? Very much so, Sir Gregory. Such complexity. Typically French. A Sauterne, isn't it? Absolutely. If I'm not mistaken, this is not Lord Mortimer's favorite wine. It is yours. In his absence, I have taken the liberty of making a slight deviation from the rule. But I count on your discretion. <laughs> Don't worry, I appreciate the same great varieties as you. I remember the last time we tasted that nectar here at this table. The finest minds of the century were present. And the last time we drank it, the orphanage in Bloomsbury was still in ruins. Would... would you repeat that? Oh, well, uh, I put some small effort into the works. The orphanage reopened just before Christmas. The bedrooms, washrooms, and the classrooms had all been refurbished. I... I don't know what to say. You have given the girls a wonderful Christmas gift. Thank you. I made a promise. Now it is done. It's the first time I've ever seen her so moved. Just mention that orphanage broke right through Emily's hard shell. Ah. Is everything all right? Yes, thank you. I had a moment of absence, but here I am again. What? What do you think of Volner? The Prussian king is his puppet. I find it hard to believe the king of Prussia is so weak. Joker Loki, a good dude, is as right? As he is dangerous. You seem to know each other well. We used to work together. I see. Mm. What a storm. What's he gonna say? Mm -hmm. Have you any information on this Napoleon? Oh dear. Mm. <laughs> Make an assumption. And you, sir. What do you think, madam? What is this Bonaparte doing here? The presence of a soldier is never a good sign. It can only mean there's going to be further war. To answer your question, I only know that his family were in favor of the revolution. And that it almost cost them their lives. Thank you, that's helpful. Hmm. Monsieur de Richet, it would seem we have common interests. Could we speak in private, please? Everyone has red eyes. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, just stand on the edge. That's a great idea. Lord Mortimer and the Golden Order through your mother have concluded a financial agreement. Stay composed, Louis. I'm listening. An agreement for cannons. Lord Mortimer assured me that you are to take over the project on behalf of your mother. You must know that I am deeply sorry about our disappearance, but I must validate the deal urgently if I want to be able to organize things properly. I haven't seen Lord Mortimer yet. I'm afraid. Oh I'll my God! To it's he me that you could replace your mother during her absence. I appreciate his confidence, but still. Appreciate. This is a bit hasty. I heard the pop and. But please continue. Of course, but I need to know if I can count you among my allies. Confrontation well, start. This and is like the battle system. I have a little <laughs> question for you. The agreement stipulates an aid of 50,000 Louis d'or for 200 cannons. Wait, what? Guess we have any I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Maybe you ought to speak to my mother. Wish we could skip oh, the conversation. I was hoping you would be up to the challenge. Too bad. Last chance failed. I have one last question I would like to pose to you. We don't know each other yet, you and I. And I need to make sure that we both share the same vision for the future of France. Given the hard times that have befallen our beautiful I'm thinking of upgrading country, all the skills so we can't just like skip things but the people would be free to choose let the people make their own cho choices you are joking I hope the people are simply not capable of taking charge don't you see they are an uneducated mob who react on the spur of the moment, incapable of providing a coherent vision for the good of the country. Another confrontation failed. I think there must be a misunderstanding. What do you mean? I cannot believe that Lord Mortimer advised me to speak to you. I must have illegitimate. Dude, we are just failing everything. Conviction costs one more. Oh my God. Please. <sighs> Bravo, Louis. Total fiasco. Dude, it's Napoleon. Who cares? I don't care. I don't want to work with this guy. I would like to say a few words, please. I would like to thank Lord Mortimer and you, Sir Holm, for bringing us all together here. Those of us for whom it is not the first time here, like me, are all trembling in sweet anticipation of the arrival of our host. For the rest, I would like to reassure you that Lord Mortimer always has a few surprising projects to propose. <laughs> but I can assure you that each and every one of us has always benefited from them. <laughs> the last time I came to this place, Lord Mortimer offered to help me in my electoral campaign for the presidency of the United States. Let me say something. I just want to see what guides they have. Most popular character and achievement guide. Mm hmm. Top rated. Um. Let's see something. Let's see if there's any. Kind of feels like it does sort of feel like a history game. I mean, it's mainly because of the characters, but.
Shoot. Hey, whatever. Right, it hopefully we just get better. That his support was I can't find a... Aid to us. Or not right this we second, are so... Among like people. So let us put aside the conflicts in which some of our nations find themselves at present. So, I raise my glass in honor of you all, my new and old friends. I trust you shall not be disappointed, Mr. Washington. Oh, so you can click right. on two? We shall meet again tomorrow. Opportunity All the fail. Will be present, as well as Lord Mortimer, I hope. How do I get rid of my stupid thing that's like holding me down? This thing. Discon disconcentrated? Disconcerted? Toxicated, dialogue timers, timers free. Do we have any points? No, we don't. Okay. Until then, I trust you will find plenty to keep you amused. Word is you can't, um, if you replay the game, you can't do anything new. Or, I mean, not to, you can do new things, but you can't, uh, what's it called? Uh, you can't skip the dialogue questions. So that's kind of rough. Etiquette, adopt their appropriate behavior. Uh, well, let's get occultism. I might honestly just get like jack of all trades, like unlock one of each. This questioning thing keeps popping up, so I need to pick this up. All right, let's recap before dinner. I was going to investigate my mother's message. I've got to find the place where all eyes size you up. Manuscripts to read. Don't have any. Actor talents. Can we get rid of that? The one? Okay. No. Find the place mentioned by your mother. I think in order to cures negative alter okay yeah we need to find a golden uh elixir well your eminence do you still have any room left ah uh, my son this scene of gluttony is the most difficult of all in my eyes nevertheless what a charming moment we have had together I'm delighted I was able to talk to Mr. Von Volner. We hadn't spoken to each other for an eternity. Yes, I noticed that your eminence knew a fair number of people at the table. The benefit of age, my son. This isn't my first invitation to Lord Mortimer's. You will see, it's the perfect place to make new friends. Indeed, I noticed that you and Mr. Bonaparte had already begun. Ah, I adapt quickly to local customs. It's what I was taught. 
<laughs> and you are right to do so, my son. But tell me, have you had any news of your mother since your arrival? <sighs> Alas, Not still nothing, your minutes. But I still haven't been able to meet Lord Mortimer. Do not worry. It is typical of him. What can I say? Lord Mortimer is a very busy man. I should think you are beginning to worry. Well, I, I must admit, Your Eminence, indeed it does worry me. I understand, Louis. But continue to have faith in Sarah. You'll see, I'm sure, that in a few days we'll all be laughing together. That's all I hope for, Your Eminence. But while I have you with me, I, I have a question for you. Well, go ahead, Louis. What can I do for you? Where are, where are all eyes size you up? Does that mean anything to you? As I haven't visited all the manor yet, I wondered if you hadn't seen a Medusa by any chance. Medusa. I beg your pardon? Yes, La, la Gorgogne, the Medusa from Greek mythology. Would you have seen one in any shape or form? Not at all, my son. I'm not sure what you're getting at, but unfortunately, I, I'm not going to be of any use to you. Thank you anyway, Your Eminence. I won't take up any more of your time. On that last word, then I shall leave you to fight your demons. See you later, Your Eminence. See you later, my son. Okay. Okay. The lock is surrounded by a triple circle. Can't unlock it. Double thorn. Beep, boop, 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 boop. Carmelite water. Discourse on the method. Ah, by nice. This A book changed the way I looked at the world. I want to listen to more audio books. But I barely, like, have time to, really. I listen to more podcasts than the only books. Sizing the ah, Golden Elixir, thank you. Oh here my. is that monumental Zeus. It can't be here. Let me get rid of that. Thank you. Does that heal our face? No. We don't have time to sit like that on Louis. What are you doing? Alright, this guy probably knows. What can I do for you, sir? I am at your service day and night, sir. I was wondering if you could help me As out. As I was unable to bring my personal effects with me, I was wondering if you could find me a few items. Of course, sir. What would you require? It probably is a secret passage. Would you have any good golden, golden you elixir? You would have a little golden elixir I could use, would you? Oh, unfortunately, sir, I have orders not to give any of that medicine to any of Lord Mortimer's guests. Some guests are here to follow a very strict treatment. Mixing or combining certain substances would be dangerous for sir. I panic, I know what it is. See, like, you need level three. Difficulty three? Or is that saying that you just need to have these? I think it's just saying that you need to have these, but the success rate might not be the best. Okay, so these are all items. What can I find? Take your lead. I would like to speak about your master, Lord Mortimer. Do please excuse me, sir, but I shall make no comment about my master. Is there anything else that sir would like to know? Yes. Can you briefly describe the ground floor, please? Very well, sir. On the ground floor, there are mainly living rooms. Sir finds himself at present in the Grand Hall. From the Grand Hall, sir can access, on one side, the small salon, where the guests like to relax with a good book. From there, Sir can access the conference room, which is closed at present for preparations. That is where Lord Mortimer likes to gather all of his guests for talks. From the other side of the Grand Hall, Sir may access the dining room. 
That is where Sir's meals will be served. From the dining room, Sir may benefit from an exceptional view overlooking the island. It is also the best way to access the portrait gallery, where a large part of hmm. Lord Mortimer's works are exhibited. And in the gallery, Sir will also find access to the garden. But Sir may be reassured that the building is accessible the gallery. on both sides, so that it surrounds the garden in question. So, Sir should not find cause to worry. No one has ever gotten lost. <laughs> The mm, giant place. So for my mother. Has Sir uh, another question? Uh, alright. I'll just walk, keep walking around. Let's try going in this room. Maybe there's that, uh, the coin that she dropped. Or something helpful, maybe? Maybe like a, a book manuscript? Hey, these look nice. like pages taken from an ancient encyclopedia. There's a pattern with five circles on this chest. And use the key. Wait, what's that? Chronicles of the Amber Princess. As I recall, Dorkin was my favorite character. Ah, damn it. If I had good agility, I'd be able to reach that. Is there a coin right here? No. It looks like it's gone. Okay. Oh, can't go that way. Cool. 